Well, welcome back to Better Living. I'm joined now by Randy Dixon, the president of the Toledo Bar Association. Of course, Randy's been on with us several times, and we've talked about different events they do. Today, we're going to take a little bit of a different turn. As everyone knows, uh, we're mourning the loss of Mayor Collins, and you know Paula Hicks Hudson, who is has stepped into those shoes and is the acting mayor for the Toledo area. I didn't realize that she's an attorney. She is. She's a, a well-known attorney to both Toledo and statewide. Uh, she served in leadership positions. Uh, she's been the president of the Thurgood Marshall uh, Law Association, which Lafayette Tolliver sure. also had served previously. Uh, Toledo Women's Bar Association, and she actually serves right now on the House of Delegates to the Ohio State Bar Association. So she has a lot of experience. A lot of experience, for sure. and and it's sometimes described as herding cats, leading uh, <laughs> leading attorneys. And he she's said good it. At it. You know, he said it. He's <laughs> the attorney, and he said it. Um, she's not the only elected official to be an attorney. I think. Uh, people sometimes wonder what their backgrounds are, and if you're voting in that race, you obviously should do your research and find out, but um, there are a lot of people that go into public office that were attorneys. That's right, um, and, and not just were attorneys, continue to be mm -hmm. attorneys, just, just like Paula Hicks Hudson. She has a private practice that she's having to wrap up right now, that, uh, you know, notifying her clients that... Uh, She's got to serve as mayor yeah. now. She's got big shoes to fill. But yeah, there's there's 26 uh, practicing attorneys that also serve in uh, in elected positions. Uh, another mayor, uh, Richard Carr, mm. uh, mayor of, of Maumee, is uh, a practicing attorney. That would be for her. I can only imagine it's. Um overwhelming to all of the sudden find out you need to do this and want to do this I'm sure that, that she wants to serve her community but you know not only is she trying to fill those shoes that are really not fillable but she also has got to take care of that personal business that's right that's right and the Toledo Bar Association can help there you know this is uh, she, she could be just putting her practice on hiatus and then have, right. uh, you know go back to to the private practice or she may move on you know um, this is a situation where the whole legal community can help and and that's what we do that's what the Toledo Bar Association can do for practicing attorneys and you know for the for the whole community right but she's ready I mean she's uh, she's served in politics before she's been on the uh, the Board of Elections mm -hmm. uh, she's actually you know similar to Mayor Mike Bell, who went down to uh, Columbus, she actually served in the Strickland, uh, you know, the Strickland administration, administration. with the uh, budget. She was an attorney with the budget. Uh, you know, the, let's let's get this right. The uh, she was the attorney for the budget uh, for the state of Ohio. That's a big title. That's right. <laughs> you don't want to mess that up, though. That's right. <laughs> Let's, um, I'm sure that the Toledo Bar Association and many practicing attorneys in our area had a lot of dealings with Mayor Collins. You're kind of running in the same circle. Um, special memories or, or your thoughts on what he did for our community? Well, you know, any, any time, and in fact, it's, it's kind of unique you know we have had our last two mayors and now our third mayor here have been in public service you know you had mm -hmm. the chief of, of uh, the fire department and then the, uh, a policeman you know mayor Collins was a policeman right. he was in the union uh, you know represented the uh, police uh, union um, he lived and breathed you know for the for the city of Toledo and it is it's an astounding loss for both the family and uh, and for the city of Toledo, and it's it's nice to know that there's processes in place in the city charter uh, for that leadership mm -hmm. vacuum to be filled at, as best we can. It it is a good thing to have those processes because imagine where we would be sitting right now if that wasn't the case. Because if I'm not uh, mistaken, and I could be, but if I'm not mistaken, I believe there used to be a deputy or a vice mayor in Toledo. I believe that's correct. Uh, when when we went to the strong mayor, uh, the the uh, president of the of the city council, the elected president of city council, then was second 
second in line. And that's what you saw here was that the mm -hmm. city council chose Paula Hicks Hudson uh, to lead council as president and uh, knew that this was certainly a possibility and she'd be the one to to fill that, to uh, fill those shoes. Well, we definitely never know what the next day is going to bring, so there's always a possibility that you're going to have to do that. Um, what do you, do you see the uh, Toledo Bar Stations Association's role in, in the next few months as she moves over? Is there any role there? Well, we've already offered to help her in wrapping up her, her private practice, and she she mainly works in the uh, juvenile court, oh, okay. representing uh, uh, both parents and juveniles. Uh, the court uh, has has offered to help in this situation and appoint uh, counsel uh, to to those parties. Uh, so yeah, we're ready. Uh, anything that she needs, she has a tremendous staff. You know, Mayor Collins yes. had a tremendous staff that include a lot of attorneys also that uh, will will be there to help. Uh, as as is the uh, are, are the members of the Toledo Bar Association. All right. Well, we appreciate your thoughts on Paula Hicks Hudson as well as Mayor Collins. If you are in need of assistance in any legal matters, that's what the Toledo Bar Association is here to do to help guide you to where you need to go. You can get with them. You can visit their website or give them a call today. We'll be right back on Better Living.